Welcome to Sunset Motors. My name is Frank Gerard. We're located in West Tennessee. Got a beautiful 2022 Fleetwood Discovery. This is the 44S floor plan. This is also a Discovery LXC, top of the line, with a beautiful full body paint. This is called the Riverstone. It's kind of different if you see all the graphic here. Beautiful. This is on a Freightliner chassis with a tag axle. This one also has an ultra steer. So that means the back tag steers when you're turning at slow speed below 20 miles an hour. That helps on your turning radius and reduce the wear on your tires. It's kind of cool. It's got the 450 Cummings, plenty of power. Got the 3000 Allison transmission. Just one good looking motorhome. It's uh. 44 foot long, 12 inch, uh, 12 feet, 10 inches tall. It's a house on wheels. Got everything you could want. You know, we'll see in a minute. The floor plan inside is incredible. This one has the technology package. So it's gonna have the mobile eye for the lane departure, collision avoidance. It's got the automatic HID headlights. And here's Camille. Hi. She's going to help us out. Got the 22 inch aluminum wheels with Michelin tires. It's got dual fuel, uh, fuel, 100 gallon fuel tank. The cargo lights on. Yep. Yes. Got quite a bit of storage. This one's got a little tray here. You can put a, a cooler or some other stuff in here. This slides all the way through, back and forth. Go ahead, open the other ones. Lots of storage. This is your ladder for your rear access. It's nice that you still have access, even on, sometimes on the big ones that they don't put a ladder, but I kind of like the ladder. So you can get up there and clean up or if you have something you need to take care of. Also, it's got the fiberglass roof, makes it real durable. There's your 50 amp automatic transfer switch with built-in surge protector. It's got the Dirt Devil Central Vac cutoff switch. There's your inverter, hydraulic system. There's the access for the engine. It's kind of all closed up, it's just a dipstick and things like that. We just had it serviced. Engine's been serviced. We're talking about oil, the oil, oil filter fuel filter, water separator, even the air filter. And that's the booger, it's right here behind. You can see the air filter. And also the batteries, these are the house batteries. There's six of them, there's six volt. There's a couple of them that didn't pass the test, so I went ahead and replaced all of them just to be safe. So you got a brand new set of batteries, all the cables been clean and protected. But sometimes even when they're just a few years old, sometimes the battery give up. Chassis battery, it's for the engine, there's two of them. There's a 13 gallon death fluid tank. We've got your water closet here. 50 amp service is on the power reel. The water hose is also on the power reel. Got a water filter, black water flush, got your outside shower, pretty easy to operate. There's your drains. You can see the blue light from the under coach lights. And this is just the access from this side. This thing is huge. It's like a bus. You can put all kind of luggage and stuff. You've got the 400D Aqua Hot. This is basically a diesel furnace. It makes you unlimited hot water. And uh, you can use also for coach heat. And it does have electric element too, so you can heat up your water with diesel fuel or electricity. Very neat feature. Here you've got your windshield washer fluid. And also you've got some uh, hoses where you can hook up an air hose and have some external air 
for a tool or even air up your own tires off the air system of the coach. It's got the 8,000 watt generator that's also been serviced. That runs the whole coach. This coach is all electric, no propane. And we'll show the awning on the on the way out. We'll go ahead and let's open the door and Got the light up panels to get in. Honestly. Oh, yeah, right there. Yep. The interior is just beautiful. Nice two tone leather, plush seats. These are power seat and heated seat. And look at the interior. How Isn't about it beautiful? the beautiful? Looks like a luxury condominium. The first thing I have to comment on is this couch. Have you ever seen such a big couch in a Ten foot home? long, I measured it. I love it. And the inside opens up to a full-size bed, which is awesome. And on each end, you have theater seating. Look at this, and it's electric. I mean, isn't this nice? And then you and got... it really lays down quite a bit. And you've got tables you can stick in those. Yeah, there's a table that goes in this little hole right here. Got a USB outlet to keep your phone charged. Cup holders are lit up. I love it. Love it, love it. Yeah. And the floor is tile and it's heated. And it's got the optional rear heat too because sometimes the rear floor is not heated. But <clears throat> this is heated, <clears throat> excuse me, throughout the whole coach. And I love this dinette. How about this U-shaped dinette? It's awesome. You could put probably five people, you four, could. at least four. Yeah. Lots of room. Yeah, I think this moves. Yeah. It. Slides out. It's very spacious. Lots mm -hmm. of. I love space. all the details, and you've got really nice cabinets. You get a lot of storage in this motorhome. I've never seen so lighted much ceiling. I also replaced. Usually, I just clean the the vents and all that. But on this one, I replaced these because they're the factory ones were not very user friendly or serviceable. These have built in little filters in them. Well, it pops. It's better with two hands, but this pops and there's a little circle filter, but I replaced all that because yeah, I didn't like the way the original was. How about a 50 inch smart TV, LG? And look here right beside it, you got plug ins. And of course, you got to have electric yeah. fireplace, and there's a safe behind the fireplace and some storage. Isn't this crazy? Um, Never would have dreamed you would have this kind of fireplace, but look at that. And some storage. Yeah, that's awesome. Got a residential refrigerator, Whirlpool, water, water, and ice dispenser. Very nice, very clean. I clean and sanitize everything. Yeah, we, we go through the whole coach and clean and fix what needs to be fixed. This is a really nice freezer. You can really stock up in this motorhome. Let's show them the kitchen area. Oh, isn't this nice? Look, you have a little island that pulls out. So you have extra counter space. And this is all solid Corian. Mm -hmm. And it's a beautiful color. It's not going to get outdated. It's got lots of storage, and that's pretty deep. It's got a nice dishwasher. How about that? A nice induction top. These are very heavy. A nice little window so you can look out outside. I love these long windows because beautiful backsplash too. It's just nice to be able to look out. And now they're doing it with a big old farm sink. Yeah, the farm sink. Nice. Got a microwave convection oven with a turning table. And this is really beautiful right here. I love the glass inserts. That you can kind of put yeah, it. yeah some food or use it like as a pantry and then you've got a deeper one Whoops. on this side. I'm down here, all right. Which is really nice. You got vents also all over the place. I think there's a total of three vents. One here. And this is your half bath. It's Kamal. a good size half nice bath. Nice sink. Nice molded sink. And wait till you see the one in the back. You're gonna ruin the surprise. No. Here's your touch screen where you can control everything. Got all your lights, your battery, your water levels. 
can see what's happening with the inverter charger. Turn all your lights, climate control. You've got three 15,000 BTU units. The rear is on the heat pump also. And you can use the aqua hot to have another source of heat. But you got three units. And the floor, front, and the rear is where you control the heat for the floor. There's all your fans. You can download an app on your phone and control this whole coach with your phone. Whatever you see on the screen will be on your app, which is a neat feature. And here we go with the master bedroom. This is probably one of my favorite floor plans for a master bedroom. I mean, this bed actually goes up. So if you want to raise it up a little bit in the back, you could raise it up if you're reading. It's on a remote bedroom. control. Yeah, it's really nice. It's all new bedding, king bed. You've got some controls up here. So you got the phone app too, but you can still control like the generator, lights, TV lift, all that from here. You've got two really nice closets. I mean, these His are and hers, just, yep. yeah. They, there's so much storage in here. I love the TV's it. on the elevator, goes up and down. Same type of material, the solid countertops. Yeah, same over here. And, and all these drawers. All the drawers. That's a lot of space. Yeah. You can go for a long time in here. And here's the... Uh, this is Frank's favorite. We've never had a shower this big in a motorhome. It's bigger it's, than a house. Yeah, it's just amazing. Look All at that. glass. I love the detail yeah, on the, the floors. Board. Even the okay. drain is beautiful. Got tile all around. The inlay on the top is just beautiful. It looks like a shell. Yeah. And you got a seat. Isn't that a teak seat? That's what it looks like. Very it's very nice. beautiful. Very, it's big. Very beautiful. And how about this dual vanity? Yeah. These sinks are like large sinks. Usually in the motorhomes, they have molded. the small sinks, but yeah. this is big. It's got a deep counter too. Yeah, and you've got so much storage back here. I mean, it, it's just amazing at all. And that's on both sides. Wow. So we love this. And of course, this is my favorite spot right here. Look how much more storage you have in here. You have another big closet. And then they've got the washer and dryer on the bottom, which I love. And then you've got all this extra storage here. Now, these are the tools for the uh, vacuum. Central vac. It was missing, so we bought a, we ordered a new one. Lots of storage. I don't know what you put in those little things, but and there's maybe there's cleaning there's, stuff. Yeah. I'm sure you can find something. But I love it. I love all this space. And then you've got your own separate bathroom area. And it's it's a nice size. I mean, it's not. Oh, we got back here. Awesome. Some more storage. storage. Put your towels and things like that. That's the control for their rear awning as a backup. It comes on a remote. But there's your other fan. If you wonder what that square is on the floor, that's for the top of the engine, rear access. Hopefully you don't need that, but it's there. I'm gonna turn around. Yeah, very nice. You've got big doors here too, if you wanna close this off for the shower. Yeah. And then you've got another one you here. You could go out with a big family. You know, there's, there's room for there is room for a big family because you got in here and then you've got this in here that pulls down a bed. Plus the bed on top. And guess what? You got a loft bed that you can uh, let down. Should we do that first? Yeah, and it doesn't feel small in here at all. Just push this button and here we go. Got one more hideaway bed. Just yeah. keep going and all the way. this still has the wrapper on it. So. Yeah. Isn't that nice? Yeah. And then there's a ladder that attaches to here that you'll see in the pictures. Kids would really have fun yeah. with this. The ceiling is nice too. You got the All right, let's show them the cockpit. Very comfortable seating. Like I said, they're heated and powered. It's got the new type cockpit. Leather wrap, steering wheel, got your controls on the 
on the steering wheel. Got automatic headlight. That's unusual on motorhomes. Usually they don't have that. Got a used screen here. Let me see here. It's booting up. You got your camera for the side camera, left camera, and then the backup camera. Got your nice, easy to read display, all your gauges. Fuel's about 80% or three quarters. Got push start, it's on a key fob like the modern car. There's an air conditioning system. You can start the generator here. The shifting is pretty simple. It's just, uh, it's kind of hard to show here, but let me see here. Yeah, that's forward and reverse. It's all right here. And you got exhaust brake going down the mountain. You can slow it down with the engine. Uh, it's got the mobile eye, which is a neat feature. It'll show you how, how, how many seconds between you and the people in front of you. And if you get too close, it'll start beeping. It also has lane departure. And it also reads the speed limit signs on the side of the road. Very cool. That's where you can dump your, your tag air if you needed to. Your, there's your shades, your docking lights, power heated mirrors. Pretty straightforward. It's got adjustable power pedal, tilt steering. There's your uh, navigation system. And it's got Apple CarPlay, Android, Auto. It's got all kind of stuff. Very cool. I think that's it for here. Probably forgot some. But let's go back inside. Well, we got right here. There's your hydraulic automatic leveling system. There's your slide out control for the front. The ones in the back or on the back wall. But just one good looking motorhome. There's some controls here. You undo the arm? Yeah, I'll just do the, this is your control for the, the big Gerard on it. You just push the remote, whoops. I gotta do all of them out. So like we said earlier, we go through the whole coach inside and out and try all the system, make sure everything's working and fix it when it's not if this is your first motorhome will take as much time as necessary to make sure you're comfortable with the unit show you how to operate it also I'm here after the sale you get my cell phone number and I'm just a phone call away if you need some help I'm running a special on this one we're going to include for the selling price we're going to include a two-year platinum warranty which is the best warranty that, that we sell this is a two-year warranty unlimited miles and it covers just about every component we're talking about engine transmission the electronics air conditioning the plumbing it's basically the same thing as you would get on a new one except this is for two years when you buy a new one a coach it's only a one-year warranty so by buying this one even though it's used, you get a better warranty than on a new one. So we thought we'd run a special. I think that's pretty good value. Peace of mind too. Well worth it. And we do also offer competitive financing available with lower terms and good interest. So if you're interested in that too, just let us know and we can guide you through that process also. We do take trade-ins. So we're trying to make it as easy as possible. Let me see, we've got uh, 105 gallons of fresh water. That's a lot of water. 75 gallons of gray water, 50 gallons of black water. We forgot this. About another 50 inch TV outside. Isn't this awesome? It's kind of freezing up because we're inside a metal building, but that's a pretty big TV for outside. I would probably forgot stuff, but there's yeah. a description. Towing package, towing package is 15,000 pounds on this one. So 
think it's got satellite. Satellite in motion and the solar panel. Got it all. Just a living room on wheels. That's true. And I'm sure there's something that we forgot. Um, but Frank does a lot of pictures. And so just go to the website and look at all that. And hey, folks, there's no better time than now to go RV. And we love RVing. You can tell that we're passionate about it. So you guys need to get your families and just go take a trip across America. We love you. And we'll see you on the next video. Thank you for watching.